Making butter might seem as simple as churning milk, but there's way more to the process. First, milk is transported to the factory where the liquid cream is separated from the milk fats through a process called skimming. The color turns from white to beige once the milk fats have become concentrated. The buttermilk is emptied and replaced by an equal amount of ice water. From there, the grains collide and meld together to create the final mass, which is known as churned butter. This is a traditional wooden kneading machine. The wooden kneader works in open air. That oxidizes the fat, which helps develop more complex flavors than more modern industrial methods. The kneading process introduces elasticity or the silkiness you expect when you eat butter. Salt is added to pull out moisture, which continues to enhance the flavor. For quality control, it's important to check the color of the butter to ensure the texture and flavors are fully developed. An unneaded and unsalted sample of butter is inserted into the processed butter. See the color difference? That's flavor and texture. Finally, the butter is shaped and packaged for sale. 